श्री सगुण वैद जी माय असिस्टेंट डायरेक्टर श्रीमान द क्यूरेटर द असिस्टेंट स्टेट लाइब्रेरियन ऑल द डिग्नेटरीज हु हैव कम अक्रॉस द गोवा एंड द इंडिया एज अ होल माय डियर लाइब्रेरियंस फ्रेंड्स माय डियर रिपोर्टर्स प्रिंट मीडिया वंस अगेन अ वेरी happy national librarians day to each and every one present over here i think uh, every person in this world want to become a richest person it may be either in terms of knowledge is concerned in terms of wealth is concerned in terms of health this concern but everybody would like to be a rich person in their respective field but if you want to become a rich in this today's era or in this world then definitely we must possess the knowledge how to tackle and how to may uh, march forward to become a rich person and to impart the knowledge we don't have a resource rather than the books and which is available in the libraries and that is why librarian plays a very vital role in making and the awareness among the people of the world today i'll just speak on the two three words that uh, think uh, grow and reach think grow and reach vicharani jar amka shrimant jar davpa gale jale vichar karat hai titne smartwatch asa a think grow and reach is a book written by the napoleon hill who was a just a 13 year old boy who started his career in writing an article in a mountain year reporting uh, paper and one day he met to a highest people who is very rich in their uh, field to name some few everybody drives a vehicle everybody drive a car there is a henry ford the light which we are getting was invented that it is a thomas thom uh, thomas edison graham bell because of him we have been communicated to each and every corner of this world and many more one day he decided his task had been given to by his reporter to take a interviews of all these legends and 500 people interviews and he have started taking the 500 people interviews going to each and every corner of this uh, uh, each country and the different parts of the world and out of out of them finally what he has realized is the 13 steps how to become a rich how to grow up the first step what we have to what these people the 500 people who has been interviewed by this uh, napoleon hill and he has collected each and every information and the common steps what they have adopted in their life to become a very successful person i will just change the word that is a instead of becoming a rich a successful person in the life first step is the desire unless and until we do not have a desire yatha shakti ichha shakti that am chandra na that it is very difficult us to reach to that successful or to achieve the goal which has been set in front by all of us i for desire it is not a just a desire word but it requires a very burning desire we have to fuel it it and from where this fuel will come the fuel will come from the books the pages the words which has been narrated by each and every person or very intellectual in that field second one is most important is that the faith 
unless and until you do not have a faith or impose a faith within you it is very difficult to used to access to the path which have been chosen by you all people then the auto suggestions what are these auto suggestions auto suggestions have to be frequently fed up to that computer or the we have to give a give a command to our brain that i have to become x y z i have to become a x y z and very important is there the specialized knowledge unless and until you do not have a specialized knowledge it is not possible us to become a very successful person and what is this successful what is this specialized knowledge specialized knowledge i always been quoting last so many years till you may be of any age a learner is not stopping is learning till his last breath and that is why when the person is having the experience it has to be shared that he has to be uh, given the advice and from this the specialized knowledge is very important to uh, be a very successful person the fifth step what i'm just wanted to know that then the organized the planning unless and until you do not have a planning it is very difficult to us to go ahead and what is planning when we have thought of doing something it should not be only in the mind but it has to be write down in a piece of paper or your page in the notebook and frequently you have to say that yes i have to do this work within the time frame because the successful people never spend their time unnecessarily they are not chatting they are only thinking something in their mind and that is why these qualities these characteristics they have possesses that will these people have become a very successful person in their life very important is that the fresh brain i will be saying what is this fresh brain the fresh brain is a fresh ideas the fresh brain is a innovative ideas for example if i just narrate this fresh brain if we want to become a very fresh a very smart i think in this today's era every woman every gentleman is going in the gym to exercise or walking um uh, uh, take a walk uh, a half an hour or one hour of a time but when we go in the gym unless why people are going into the gym people are going to the gym because they should build their physique or the muscular body unless until they lift the dumbbells it is not possible then to get a shape to their um, muscles and that is why unless and until we are not going to lift the books we are not going to mold our brain and that is why these are the very important characteristics these are the very important things to be done in the life and that is why we have to very focus our life in that respective directions then comes to a sixth sense and what is this sixth sense there are six seven types of sense the touch the hearing and the smell everything everybody you knows about this characteristic but when we have the plenty of knowledge about all these senses and everybody has given a two eyes two legs two um, hands everything but we are we are just uh, loitering our time in a very different directions and that is why it is not possible many of the people many of those especially i'm talking about the students that there are two things whether it is possible me to do it or 
you must say yes i can do it there are the two things there are two lines which has a very different uh, you know, words and when it is possible us and when we are firmly decided by our brain yes i can do it then only it is possible you to do or you to be a very successful person in the every field now i just quoted that i just wanted to become a very rich person some of them has wanted to have a vast um, uh, wealth some want to want to become a very uh, rich in the health some people want to be a uh, rich in the knowledge and this knowledge is very important out of all three these three, three words i will just give a more weightage to the knowledge because if you possess is the knowledge then only it is possible you to earn a well or to be a very healthy person and from where you are going to get the knowledge knowledge is going to be get from the books and the books are available in the libraries and that is why these libraries are very key very important uh, field to mold to shape up uh, or to give a very path road map to his individual life and that is why dr s v ranganathan has been called as a father of libraries who has given every knowledge who has taught from the different angles and because of this uh, these are the very qualities and the libraries are to be taken to each and every corner of this world or i'll say the nation and that is why i have given i shown to the floor of the house during the last my assembly session where every village has to be connected with the digital library so that our upcoming students or the people should come to their library should get the knowledge and uh, be a very successful person in the chosen career we also decided see on one 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 summer time one summer time there are no libraries at all but still the people still the people sitting in the home or whatever the material get the uh, at that time they have got or purchases they have just go, go through it and just they have done what they have now actually the education i am not going to give the more importance to the education because the thomas edison has gone only 3 months in a school only 3 months in a school he has done the schooling of only 3 months but he has become a very great inventor great researcher why he has not got the got the any schooling knowledge and this is the knowledge because there are so many people so many people legendary people uh, um children are not going into the school nowadays they are studying in the house and um, houses they are reading they are going to the different uh, uh, magazines and imparting the knowledge to develop their skills and reaching to the next level i just would like to conclude my speech that every librarian has to work and he should not or he or she should not work for the salary they have to be a very 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 social to give the knowledge to the needy person and unless or until we are not going to make the awareness among the uh, first of all our we take the neighbors the family members it is one to one mouth publicity is the strongest of publicity it is wild and that mouth publicity and you are the instrumental person the librarians are the instrumental person to impart this knowledge or to give the multi level marketing and that is why our government my government has decided to go to each and every level and that is why director of art and culture the central library has decided to come out with the library policy i think if i am not mistaken dr goa ji our library policy will be the first of its kind in the entire india and this can be possible only with your support with your blessing and this just wanted to give to the nation and for that i think the library will take 
to a very next level, greater heights. And I wish you all the best for presenting your papers over here. And once again, a happy National Library Space to each and every one.